Uh, Coach, it uh, seemed like every time the ball got thrown into Asia, about two, three are coming at her. Uh, how would how would you try to counteract that uh, when you're going to see that, you know, again, coming Friday? Well, I mean, with their, I, they're just leaving people. I mean, I think they have a special defense called Blue, and they just don't guard people. They just go guard Asia. So the way you counter that, I mean, she got rid of it. She had six assists tonight. She played the right way. Um, at, at a certain point, if you're going to put two or three people on somebody, somebody else has to, like, make some shots. Again, though, throw up the offense. The offense was not the problem. It was the defense. So, I mean, it, what would he score, 87? That's enough points to win a basketball game, but not when you're giving up 100. And it was basically right from the go. We're helping, I mean, oh my God, we're just breaking our own rules constantly. It's just undisciplined. It's just undisciplined. They know what they're supposed to be doing. And they have to go out there and execute. It's just undisciplined. And, um, you know, so you're trying different lineups all the time. Um, we'll, we'll go back and, and see what we can do better. But um, that's not a team you can give open shots to. We were unable to close out to the three-point line and then keep them in front. That's it. No, like we could not keep them in front. They got downhill, drive and kick, or they set a screen and we wouldn't communicate. Two people would go up one, one would slip. I mean, it was a mess. Um, you know, you talked about finding a defensive identity, you know, still trying you know, to build that process going through it. Is it different things uh, every night, every game that is, or is it something consistent that you guys are looking to <clears throat> on the defense end? Oh, we did a really good job. The other night against LA. And then completely different now. LA has completely different personnel. And Minnesota has shooters everywhere. So you can't bring as much help and dig and activity that we were against LA where it kind of looked smothering at times. Um, this team is completely different. You have to be able to guard some one-on-one -on -one people. Um, and you have to be able to know what you're living with, which we were okay with long off the dribble twos. Now, Courtney Williams made quite a few of them, but it was the other parts. It was the 10 assists that was really killer because now she's drawn to, now she's getting everybody else involved. So not only is she knocking down shots, but she's getting wide open ones um, for everybody else. So those are the ones that really, um, you know, the wide open shots, the horse shots, those are the ones that drive me crazy. Becky, obviously we see what the schedule is, right? Matter of 48 hours, you get a chance at them again to take them on. What is the focus uh, in the next 48 hours as far as uh, your team? Uh, I understand obviously you have a travel day, but uh, just are there some aspects that, that you can take a look at before you uh, face them on Friday? Yeah, of course we're going to take a look at it. We're going to take a look at it, make our adjustments, um, see if we can't make some things cleaner um, for them. Uh, so there's not so much confusion in between. I thought we had a pretty clean game plan going into it, but it looked like a mess. So uh, we'll go back to the drawing board and uh, see if we can't clean some things up. But rest is probably the main thing.